We, uh, we have a dog, uh, dog lovers in the room. Yes? <laughs> Sweet. We love our dogs. So we have, a, we, have a, we have a yellow lab, okay? And he just turned 16 years old, which is a very big old dog, right? Uh, his name is Turbo, <laughs> which is a great name for a puppy. It's a horrible name for a 16-year-old dog. Uh, I feel bad now, because when I call him, I just feel like I'm mocking him, you know? Come on, Turbo! <laughs> Come on, boy. Don't feel bad for him. He's in great shape, or he wouldn't have made it to 16, obviously. We had him professionally trained by this guy, and he taught him voice commands and hand commands, so no matter where he was, he always came back. Flash forward, 16 years, he's still with us. Uh, the only difference now is he can't hear as well as he used to. So at least the hand signals kind of work like sign language, which is pretty cool. I can still communicate. Um, the other day, out of habit, I just happened to be, Turbo! And I got this. <laughs> right? Now he can't see. Now I have a blind, deaf dog. I have the Helen Keller of dogs. <laughs> the only way I can communicate with him now is to take his paw, put it up to my lips, sit. <laughs> You guys are on it. Good for you. Good for you. Good. Usually, I don't want to say it, but usually it's millennials come up to me after a show and they'll say, so you're talking about your dog? Yeah. So uh, I'm supposed to believe your dog can write? I'm like, what? Oh, okay. So I said Helen Keller. You're thinking Anne Frank. But I like where you're going with this. Uh, so my dog was hiding in the attic from the German shepherds, right? I must tell my story. If you've got a better theory, share it afterwards. Okay. Uh, so this is great. So my dog retires at 13 years old. Okay, Turbo retires because he's done at that point. The reason, this is how you find out, because dogs can't tell you, right? Basically what happens is this. Ding dong. Come walking out, I'm like, what is happening? I gotta step over him, answer the door, you know? But I figure at 13 years old, you know, he's tired, you know, he's resting his bones to do the things I need him to do, which is eat his food and go outside to the bathroom, and I'm fine. If that's his retirement, I'm fine with that. That's the retirement I want, right? So, he, uh, but at 13 years invested in the family, obviously he's gonna protect us if there's a problem, you know? So if there's a stranger at the door, you get this. Somehow we feel safe, so <laughs> I don't know. He's great. Um, 